You okay, officer? Stay where you are. 11 years ago, elementary students across the country lived through the horrifying terrorist attacks on September 11th, a day that left our country reeling and our military forces on high alert. A little over a decade later, those same military forces are growing in rank with student soldiers from the University of Georgia, those former elementary students like UGA senior Kayla Lachance, who couldn't really comprehend 9-11 at the time. I was only in sixth grade at the time of September 11th, so it was a little more of OK, I don't really know what this means at first. What she does remember about her life then has influenced her motivation to seek a career in the armed forces now. Growing up, military members were always heroes to me because of the sacrifices they made. And just to be able to come and do this now, um, it's me giving back to them. Tyler Lewis, another ROTC student at UGA, felt the direct effects of being in a military family on 9-11. Of impact. My uh, dad was in the National Guard and he got called up that day on September 11th. So that was the first time I ever saw him mobilized because I was young still. I was only in fourth grade. So you can imagine, like, I saw that and I saw how he had to react with that. And ever since then, as I grew up, I wanted to help families like, you know, like our family. One ROTC professor says the maturity and dedication these students possess is inspiring. It's motivating to see that there are students coming in and there are going to be officers coming in that are going to take up the mission when I retire and be able to do it. Student soldiers may not remember everything about 9-11, but the anniversary of that fateful day does inspire them in the path they have chosen for a career. It forms kind of like a family, and that's what people don't really realize, is that when you join the Army, you're joining a greater, bigger family. That family is what brings these students together on an anniversary like 9-11. In Athens, Mamie Shepard. Grady News Source.